You guys, I just had a meeting with the school principal and whew, I'm gonna tell you something. Um, it wasn't very fun. To today's video. I am very excited to share with you guys today because we get to take you guys back to the past year of all the accomplishments we've had and to the future. And I also wanted to let you guys know before we get started that today's video is sponsored by Haven Life. And if you don't know what Haven Life is, it is an online insurance agency that's made buying dependable term life insurance actually simple. Yes, we have had a awesome last year and we've accomplished so much, which has really got Tal and I thinking about how we can protect our kids live and pay should anything ever happen to us. So as you guys know, we took a huge step as a family this past year. We bought this amazing house. Check it out. Yeah, today, you guys, is literally the last night that we are gonna stay in this house. This is the last night. I, I don't feel ready because I feel like we still have- We still have a lot packing. to do, yeah. So that's a little bit stressful, but we got all day today. We were actually heading over there right now to check on some flooring stuff and start our day because we have a lot of packing to do on our last day ever in this house. I cannot still believe it. All right, so I wanna show you guys a little bit of what we've done today in the house. Um, we got the baseboards, like all the, it's basically called, called like caulking, so they basically like, take all of it so there's no gaps. So they have to finish uh, painting tomorrow. Another thing that we finished today was my office. Um, and, it, and when I say finished, I mean we got a lot of furniture in there. We haven't really finished everything because we still gotta put a lot of decor and stuff in here. But here it is, I got my workspace over there, my guitars, a really cool like um, hide I guess. And this is just, this isn't even real, this is completely fake. <laughs> So I seriously love this house and all the fun we have in it, but taking that huge step has really got us thinking about how blessed we are, about our future, and being prepared for our future. I feel like when you're prepared, you have a little bit more peace of mind to just kind of live your lives. And we have a pretty crazy, busy, fun life. <laughs> Life asked us to partner with them, it was literally the perfect timing. Because a life insurance policy can really help protect our family's future. So with the right amount of coverage in place, a policy can help Natalia cover things like the mortgage of the new house, child care for live and pay, and even day-to-day -day bills. And it also works in reverse for me as well, so it's important that we both have coverage. So even though we're online every day, we don't want to spend all our time trying to figure out how to buy a term life insurance policy. So Haven Life made it super easy to apply. I could even use my phone and the website was super easy to navigate. So that was very helpful. Yeah, and I actually shopped for myself for a 20 year $500,000 policy plan. And I was actually very surprised at how affordable it was. Best of all, the Haven term policy is actually issued by Haven Life's parent company, Mass Mutual. That's a leading insurer that's been around for more than 160 years. So buying or researching life insurance does not have to be daunting or intimidating, you guys. Haven Life has made it very easy. We are so thankful that Haven Life is sponsoring today's video and we have looked into everything they have to offer you guys. An insurance policy truly gives us the peace of mind for our family's future. We are truly thankful for everything that we have in this life and we also wanna be responsible as parents. So if you guys want to check out Haven Life, click the link in the description box below and you guys can receive a free quote today. You ready? Yeah, let's get out of here. You guys, I just had a meeting with the school principal and whew, I'm gonna tell you something, um, it wasn't very fun at all, but. What school principal? Yeah, your school principal and Sissy's school principal. So here's the deal, you guys. Basically, I don't know if you know, but we are not the type of people that come on time regularly. We always are either pushing it right there on the, on the button or we're a little bit late and sometimes we're a little bit early. It just fluctuates. We also live 30 minutes away from the school. So getting there on time can be very, very hard. 
Hold on, distraction. Oh, she's building some carrots. So anyways, we try and get there on time and usually we're really good, but there's some times where we are a little bit late and it's not that big of a deal, honestly. It's more just me getting frustrated that I'm late and I went in and talked to the principal today and I said, listen, I don't know what to do. I literally live 30 minutes away. If there is even a minor accident on the freeway, I'm gonna be late. And she basically was like, hey, we're trying to instill this into the kids early. And I'm like, I understand that, but my kid doesn't drive, I drive. I need to know, I'm not gonna keep going and going and going, but I need to know in the comments what you guys think about tardies. Do you think it's important um, at their age now to start learning about this type of stuff? I do think it is important. However, I don't think it's that important to where we have to punish the kids, which lives not getting punished, but it's, I don't know. Then we also had a conversation of where she's gonna go to school next year. So yeah. one of our issues that Ty and I have talked about, we have way too much going on in our life yeah. to have them go to school um, and not miss school. So is it okay if they miss school? <sighs> There's just a lot going on, you guys. And I had a meeting with the principal and it yeah. didn't start off great, but Daddy. it ended really well. So that's my story about my school principal Daddy. meeting. Um, um, Molly, uh, um, drink, uh, maybe she's thirsty. You think Molly's thirsty? Mm -hmm. Okay, go get us some water, baby. Good job. Good morning, Molly. Good morning, pretty girl. We are finally all together. Woo! How are you guys feeling? Woo! Dad's feeling good and happy about that. How are you? <laughs> We just um, had dinner with some friends and had a really good time. Hey, look time. at there's some of them right there. Check them out. Oh, there's some of the friends. Look at them. Look at them. Let's see if we can zoom in on them. Uh, zoom. Zoom. Did zoom. 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 Well, oh, we're getting honked at. We're getting honked at. But we just had a good time hanging out with some friends and we got shown this super crazy video and I want to share it with you guys because it was pretty hilarious. So funny. Oh my god. Like gosh. hilarious but also a little bit sad. So check it out. You got this, sister. You were super, super close. Right in the kisser. Show that knight who's boss. Oh, oh. oh God. I can feel my face when I'm with you. But I love it. Okay, seriously, I had like tea. What? Oh, my bad. She's sleeping. She's sleeping. Oh, she looks so precious. She looks so precious. What if I tickle yeah. her right here? She's still sleeping. Oh, I see a smile. I see a smile. <laughs> okay, so what I was gonna say, and I'll say a little quiet, was I was crying in tears when I saw that video. Um, I thought it was so funny. So I need you guys to let me know in the comments below, like your first initial thought when that happened. When you saw that watermelon hit the lady in the face. What was your so first? Crazy. I would have been oh crying. Oh my gosh. She was so tough. I feel bad. If if that person ever watches our vlog, I just want to let you know that I, I feel, I don't can't say I feel your pain because I really don't ever want to feel that pain, but I feel bad. But it was pretty funny. Uh, what do you got right there? Are you trying to prank me again? You trying to prank us? I found those snakes all over. All over. I tried to there was up. one in my bed. There was one in her side of the bed. There was one in the closet. In the drawer. In the drawers. Pajama drawer. Pajama drawer. <laughs> All right. You guys gotta go get in the shower. Get ready because you guys okay. both have school tomorrow. <gasps> oh, let me see your cute little face. Let me see it. I can't see it. I can't see it. There it is. It's so cute. What if we tickle it? <laughs> what if we tickle it? Does she wake up when we tickle her? <laughs> Ow! Stop! Stop! Ow! Ow! Crazy! Oh, 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 that's like a snake whip. You're crazy. All right, go get ready for bed. Go get ready for bed. Go, 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 go. Whoa! Whoa careful. <laughs> Got my precious snake. <laughs> Shh. Quiet. Okay. Confession. Not our confession, no, our husband's confession. confession. We like caramel corn. We do like caramel corn. Let me know if you like popcorn. What's your favorite kind? Uh, anyways, our husbands are obsessed with Fortnite. Okay, so. Benefit for us though, because we hang out all the time. They're playing right now, and I just wanted to give a little sneak peek. Like a little, a little sneak a peek. Little? I just heard bush, that's what I heard. Oh. 
<laughs> like this. <laughs> they talk to each other on their headphones. Like if you guys saw it, it would be so entertaining. Look at this, she is Fortnite. Her Fortnite. She is Fortnite. Fortnite. Let's <laughs> go. Wait, put the camera in Fortnite. <laughs> oh, hey, I'm distracted, dude. They're filming me. We're Fortniteing. Look. Fortnite? Yeah, like, They're hiding in bushes. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my car <laughs> You're supposed to be super entertaining now, like when you yell at each other. Hey, Bob, they're filming us, Bob. <laughs> she won't know I'm here. She won't know I'm Another here. Another one her element. Hi. Hi. <laughs> you look so cozy over here. It was like a silent. I'm ready to go to sleep. Oh. <gasps> Go to sleep. Oh, oh, just kidding, I'm ready to party. Oh my God, she charted. Oh no, so You're we had caramel corn. 20, that's the perfect popcorn. I did This is caramel corn. It's caramel corn. You don't even act like a know-it-all. So that Bye. was the last caramel corn I had. I just brought one, but that's okay. We'll find something else to eat. There that goes. <laughs> we are gonna end today's vlog, but before we do that, I wanna tell you all about my day. So first, like, we, we had a did lot of fun today. And we had the best time we ever asked. Yeah, and what was your favorite part of the day? Uh, the getting the Starbucks. Getting Starbucks, yeah, we got Starbucks. And now we are gonna do, what are we gonna do now, Peyton? Shout out! First, the first one is, is Olivia. Olivia. And the next one is from Peyton to Brianna. And, and to get Shout it out. All you have to do is click the, the bell. bell. Yeah. And we will try to shout you guys out. And then now we will end today's vlog. Do you like the today's video? Give it a, a thumbs, thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And, and see you guys tomorrow. Peace.